Shalom and welcome to Mitzvah Torah. This year is entitled Daf Yomi Barbasa Kuf Nun Hey. The one who talks to more on Kuf Nun Hey is talking about the sale that a young child made. And the relatives are wondering, is it a legitimate sale or not? Maybe when he made the sale, he was a katan. What do you mean? He's 13. Then we know he's 13 already. So it's very important to understand. Most people assume that a gadol son who's 13 and a katan son who's less than 13. It's only partially correct. A gadol in halacha is someone who is 13 and has signs, physical signs of puberty, of maturity. That is who is a gadol. So the question is, how do we go ahead and have every bar mitzvah boy lane and join minion, zim and all that? So it's quite a shocking answer. When it comes to many mitzvah, Specifically, where his status as a gadol is needed only midrabanan from the rabbis, then we assume that he is 13 and has signs of maturity. We assume there are signs of bagrut, that he has the shtei sarot, and therefore we let him daven for the minion. We let him join a zimun. Let him be part of the kila in that way. But what happens if he's a 13-year-old and we need him to perform a mitzvah from the Torah, Chalitza, Amalek, Kinyanim, transactions? Not enough. The assumption only applies by rabbinic mitzvot. The chazaka, the rava, the chazaka that he has maturity is by rabbinic mitzvot only. Therefore, when we see this Gemara saying, wait, they're challenging. Maybe he made a kinyan when he was 13 and he did not yichte sarot. And then the question is, well, maybe we have a right to assume that they, the either witnesses checked it. Why do you need yichte sarot? The answer is he's not a gadol halachically until he has 13 plus yichte sarot. That's the halacha regarding them any mitzvah do raita. Jarbanan, we also want him to be a gadol, but we simply make the assumption, the chazaka, that when he's 13, we assume the yichte sarot as well for the mitzvah to Rabbanan, that will suffice, but not for mitzvah do raita. Shalom.